What's up, ladies? Listen, this is a quick word for those that have been in relationship with their kingdom spouse and they have stopped communicating or they have uh, dwindled down in their communication. They are dealing with what has what has taken place in their past the things that they have started and and done outside of the will of the most high how to come to you correctly a lot of things are going through their minds and they're trying to figure out what to do how to do it how to move with you how to talk to you because you are a woman of the most high and he knows that he can't just come to you any kind of way and he's dealing with a lot of things so give him grace ladies give him grace a lot of um, kingdom spouse uh, prodigals, these are prodigals that are here one minute and they're gone the next or they've been gone and they came back and they left whatever, where there's uh, inconsistency in communication, where there's an inconsistency in uh, growth and movements, uh, any of that they are trying to get to a place where they are right for you they don't feel worthy of you they don't feel like they deserve you and it's only because they have not solidified the uh relationship that they have with our father to the place where they fully understand that they full well deserve it but they have been with so many different um not so many different they have been with multiple people whether it's two three four whatever that have totally treated them like trash like they were worthless even family members so they don't know what it is to be loved properly with the love of the most high they don't even know how it is to be properly loved with a portion of the most high's love with being you know like a mother that was maybe a religious person and maybe had some of that love but didn't have that they don't even know that okay so we have to remember and that's i'm not just saying that that scenario it could be other scenarios don't don't box god in don't box in your love story because the most high is creating all of our love stories differently and they're all intricately intricately designed thank you holy spirit just to suit us okay you and your kingdom spouse me and my kingdom spouse to suit us because he knows his children he knows each and every detail about us he knows the numbers of head numbers of number of hairs thank you holy spirit on our heads so you think he don't know everything else so just remember to give them grace i know it's hard i know you got so y'all then started talking and everything was going good and then uh, all of a sudden nothing don't charge it to their heart charge it to their trauma charge it to the fact that they are dealing with a lot of things not only are they a man first and foremost in in today's world where men are not valued i'm just gonna say it but not only are they dealing with that they're dealing with their traumas they're dealing with their past with the counterfeit possibly they may not all have a counterfeit but most of them do they're dealing with the fact that their uh counterfeit is worldly and they're trying to get them a hard time whether it's about the divorce whether it's about um they may have children together and not have ever been married and they're giving them a hard time with that uh, threatening them to do certain things if they don't do this if they don't do what they tell them or ask them to do oh well you're not gonna see your kids or you know just just a bunch of worldly foolishness so remember that they are fighting battles that you have no idea about and they're not gonna tell you because they don't want to stress you out you're a woman of god he puts you in a high stature and he does not want you to even know about these things possibly yet give him grace y'all he'll come around pray about it sit at the most high's feet contend for your prodigal contend for your kingdom spouse that is what that is one of the biggest duties of a help meet to contend for her family contend for her kingdom spouse contend for the faith don't ever forget it ladies but give him grace give him time don't hound him don't be an extra stress let him move how he gonna move and you move with the most high by prayer I promise you, you'll never go wrong. Peace and blessings, guys.